Oh, Dao means you've fallen over. Dao. Okay. So don't say Dao. 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 Okay. Dao. Oh, 不好意思。好，还有谁？ Relay, re relay, is it? Dao, dao, 谢谢 Relay, relay, yeah, relay, relay. Okay, dao, Bradley, dao. Yay! Uh, Paspita, dao. 谢谢 Okay, Ma, uh, Ma, uh, Mario, dao. 很好 And Manuel, dao. 谢谢 Okay, Anna. Down. Good. April. Down. Good. Uh, Gusti. Down. Good. Elma. Down. Ah. What about Elma? Over. Over. This is how you spell your name. Over. E L M A. Over. 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 Oh, I would say Elma. Elma, Elma. Okay, I'm English. Just forget. You know, everything's Ma for me. Elma. Okay, Rucho. Thank you. Okay, wonderful. So all of you are here. And they go. Are you feeling hot? Okay, we, we turn on the fan for your children. So. What a nice teacher. <laughs> yeah. All right. Okay, so put your pens down and like, just relax for a little bit. Okay. Close. I know you're all like, Ooh, like this. Uh, close. Relax, relax. Okay. Yes, relax. Yeah, relax. Okay, I need to. So just listen. Imagine you're a cloud like what we do. Okay, relax. Just relax. Close your eyes. We do a bit of uh, uh, meditation. Meditation. Okay, so just uh, listen to my uh, listen to my voice. Okay, now Bradley will probably know. Uh, we should sing a song. Relax, relax. <laughs> but we won't sing that song. Okay, it's not not appropriate. Okay, this one. Okay, imagine that you are lying on your back on the grass on a warm summer day. And that you are watching the clear blue sky without a single cloud in it. You are lying very comfortably. You are very relaxed and happy. You are simply enjoying the experience of watching the clear, beautiful blue sky. As you are lying there, completely relaxed, enjoying yourself, far off on the horizon, you notice a tiny white cloud. You are fascinated by the simple beauty of the small white cloud against the clear blue sky. The little white cloud starts to move slowly towards you. You are lying there, completely relaxed, very much at peace with yourself. Watching the little white cloud drift slowly towards you. The little white cloud drifts slowly towards you. 
you are enjoying the beauty of the clear blue sky and the little white cloud. Finally, the little white cloud comes to a stop overhead, completely relaxed. You are enjoying this beautiful scene. You are very relaxed, very much at peace with yourself, and simply enjoying the beauty of the little white cloud in the blue sky. Now, become the little white cloud. Project yourself into it. You are the little white cloud. Completely confused, puffy, relaxed. Very much at peace with yourself. Now, you are completely relaxed. Your mind is completely calm. You are pleasantly relaxed, ready to proceed with the lesson. Okay, we can't now. Right, <laughs> relaxed. Now, of course, once you're relaxed, we have to do the test. <laughs> oh, 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 oh. So, have <coughs> a piece of paper out. Okay, get a piece of paper around me. So get a piece of paper out and we'll do a test. Okay. Uh, the teacher will read and you have to write down the pinyin and the toes. And and the characters, okay? Uh, all right. Oh, oh, oh. <laughs> they all. Only I do this. The pinion, so I have a So you have a piece of paper. Okay. 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 So not using this. Uh, <laughs> oh, are, are you giving it to them? Okay, hi, give it to them. 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 Okay, hi, give it so you don't need to read it, and you can read it. Are you ready? Oh, wait. Oh, OK. Oh, wait. 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 Oh, wait.
to be verb, to be verb, to, to be verb, be verb, be verb. <coughs> Number four, surname.
seven. Nen. Nen. Name. 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 That's right. You know. Name.
中文很好哎、欸。I will read number one, number two for Eddie. Number one. How? Number one. You're already done number one. Ah, okay. We're only doing it for Alice. Yeah. Don't panic. Number one. Goodbye. Bye.
this one has unit two characters. So what's this one? No, no, this one. Gay. That's right. And you can listen to the sound. Okay, oh, this is a guy saying it. I'm gonna change it. Change it nice female voice. Okay, gay. Okay. And then this is the flash card. So you can learn that's gay. Uh, pronunciation and the spelling. Alright. That's that's Jia Jia Shao. So oh I I am gonna change something because the kind of the, the guy's voice is horrible. Okay. It's a machine voice, okay? Jia Shao. Okay. So Jia Shao. So Jigana. Did we test today? Jiga. Mm. Mm. Oh. Oh, we, we, we didn't test it. No. We didn't test it. Xian Shen. Xian Shen. Oh, yeah. Xian Shen. Xian Shen. Mr. Xian Shen. Ah. Jiga na. Tai Tai. Tai Tai. Tai Tai. Tai Tai. Tai Tai. Tai So every, every unit you have all the vocabulary on the net for you to study. Okay? So now, for those people who are not quite sure with their characters, I need to also give you some help with... Um, uh, so you can all join on your line. Have you joined? Because if you join, I can see you. I can see you as uh, as you have joined. Okay. So if you if you join this class, which I sent online, you should be a member, and I should be able to see the members going at least for another eleven people here. Okay. So uh, so how, so please join now. Uh, this is very useful because if you download the app, if you download the app, you could do it at any time. Okay, on your on your on your phone, you can do it any time you have a spare five minutes. Just use Quizlet. Okay, so please join now if you can. You, you've got the link, right? You might have to download the app. Anybody in here? Okay. Wait, 143, you probably have to go to the Okay. 
，加进去了。为什么看不到你们？你们在哪里 ？Where are you？ 你们在哪里？啊 ，Is this one of you？ Elijah？ No。If you can do it, it will be fine because basically you need to uh, you need to do it. Uh, Everybody in? Did you all download the app? So you're in, you're in, you're in, you're in, you're in, you're in. Are you in? In? Okay. You need to download the app, okay? Uh, Google will not give it to you. You need to download the app. Have you downloaded the app? Question? Yeah. Yeah. Okay. 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 We have three. You need to go down, scroll down to find number two, one, two, and three. Okay? I can I can I can control everything except how the computer displays things. Because this is not within my capability. So uh, it's, it's, uh, you need to find it. Yeah. <clears throat> Alright. Some of you are having trouble with characters. Now, I'm uh, going to help you with certain ways of writing. Okay. Okay. Now characters are composed of okay, I'll ask you. What are characters composed of, Alice? Ready? What are what are radicals? So they are very things the the smallest the smallest unit of a character is a stroke. Uh -huh. A stroke. Okay. Now, after the stroke, you have radicals. All right. Now, radicals. Now, the English word for radicals meaning root. Okay, meaning root. So therefore, just think about radicals as roots of a character. What does it mean with root? Is that you add other things to it so that it becomes another character. <coughs> now, uh, traditionally, people will say characters characters are uh, like pictures. Uh, only about ten percent are like pictures. If, you, if all Chinese characters are like pictures, we cannot express any concepts, all right? So only 10% are like pictures. Everything else is a combination of everything. So forget about the picture again, okay? But they are added with other things. So radicals is the basic root. And then you have the characters. You have the characters. Uh, uh, with different structures. Okay, 
Let's look at the characters we did today. I'm going to uh, ask you to participate rather than me saying everything. What are the structures of Zai? What, what do you think the structure of Zai is? There are several possibilities. Up and down or, or up and down, two ones or side by side, you know, side by side. This, this bit is the radical, this bit is the character. So what are the different structures of, uh, of characters? What's jie, for example, what's jie? What's the, what's the, what's the structure? We're talking about jie gou, ha? We're talking about the structure here. What structure of jie? Look at the character. Top to bottom or side to side? Top to bottom. Top to bottom. Wonderful. So this is one type of structure and is top and to bottom. Okay. Guess what the top represents? Guess what the top represents? Person's eyes turned back side. Right. So, Jian, what does it mean, Jian? To see. So, you know, it's the eyes to see. Okay. So, it's Jian. So, this is the eyes radical. Okay? And you will see this radical comes in different shapes. Okay, sometimes it's like it's like this, sometimes it's like that, but they're all jian. They're all to do with eyes. Okay? Right. So this is one radical which is top to bottom. Right? Okay. What about zai? What kind of structure is zai? Huh? The same top to bottom. Okay. But Zai also now for those people who are finding it very hard to learn, invent a story for yourself. And if you don't know the story, you don't know what to invent. I will invent a story for you. And then you remember, see, hopefully you can remember by the story. Zai comes from original Chinese. I read some on the internet. It's a story of fish and a net. The fishermen go and catch fish. And it goes down into the net. And it continues to go down. So remember what's the meaning of zai. Zai, see you again, is again and again and again. So Zai Jie is see you again and again and again. So this is why it's that Zai. Okay? Now, Chinese have a lot of these. You need to know the structure. Okay? In this week's characters, which one are the top to bottom structures. What's the next one? What about shi? shi. Yes. Shi is top to bottom structures. And which ones are the left to right uh, structure? Huh? Yeah. Uh, Lai is a bit more complicated yeah. because uh, Lai has many uh, in but fact, that, has many other that, bits, that, right? That, yeah. Yeah. So this char this character is not quite uh, <coughs> top to bottom. It's got left and right, top to bottom, everything, right? It's yes. more complicated. But number four, C is left and right. 
Okay? C, left and right. C, left and right. C, left and right. Notice this is one stroke, not two strokes. And jiao. Left, left and right. Good. And uh, shen ma. Shen is left and right. Very good. Shen ma. But ma is slightly different. It's top to bottom. But uh, with ma, which thing is the radical? Which bit is the radical? Which bit is the radical? Have a guess. It's the top bit. Okay? It's the top bit. So remember the top bit is always the radical. Okay. Now, girls, can I ask you one thing? I know when you write in English, it, you like to have every all the everything like here very very curly and very beautiful like flowers right in chinese you don't do that okay it's just straight up and down <laughs> see i can see somebody's writing very prettily but you can't write this in chinese it's up and down okay so like uh, who is this this is uh, mario your 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 ma is a uh, pretty very pretty but people we'll see what is this okay so Try not to make it too pretty. Just straight up and down. Okay. And what about me? What structure? Up and down. Exactly. Good. Me up and down. Zi. No. Zi. Zi is also up and down, but it's a bit like a roof with something inside. So this is the radical. This is the radical. Okay, this is the radical with something inside. Now, in Chinese, the rule is if you want to put something into a house, into a box, you build a house first. Okay, so you don't write this and then the house. You write that, the roof, and then the house. Okay, there's a logic to it. Okay, zhe. What about zhe? Zhe. Yeah, top to bottom. Which one is the radical? The roof. The, the, not quite the roof. It's a... Uh, it's this one. What is this one? It's actually somebody walking. Okay. So it's the walking radical. So imagine your walk. And also, there is another walking radical. Uh, let me have a look because I'd like to see whether you have made this mistake. Okay. Uh, uh, okay. One person left the one thing, but you haven't made the mistake. Now, Good. Oh, or shi. There is one. Some of time you forget that thing, huh? And also, shi shi. This 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 bottom here is walking again. Now, fortunately, nobody wrote like this. Okay, because I don't know how you walk like this okay so you cannot walk like this so chinese never write like this fortunately i haven't seen anybody writing like that the reason is like this is we're walking like this we're walking like this so this one is longer and this one is actually from here not from there okay is it the same as yes same as that's right and similarly uh, is like that. It's kind of very much like this, except it's like the screw. Zico right. has, has a different uh, stroke count for yeah. Zhe. Zhe, yeah. Clico has it. It's different. Different. Uh, sometimes it's different. It depends on how they count uh -huh. and how they write. Now, Chinese character when you see Clico might be different from the book because we have different fonts. And sometimes they represent the fonts differently, okay? 
for example, C, I think, I like it, somebody was writing it like this, and somebody was writing it like that, and I, I think you need to write it like this, C, okay? So it depends on what Plico does, okay? So zhe, now, one thing, zhe, very important. How many parts are there? How many parts are there? What's, what's, uh, what, uh, how many parts, Rachel? Three parts. Okay, how many parts are there? Two. Two. What about the others? What do you think? How many parts are there? How many parts in this character? Two. Two. Okay. Two is correct. But I'm fascinated by your three counting. I don't know. See, she counted. Some people, uh, uh, non-Chinese speakers, divide things into too many parts. In the end, you can't remember how many they are. If you really want to be extreme, there won't be three. There will be one, two, three, four, five, six parts, logically. But my god, who's going to remember? Six parts to write a character. Nobody does it. Chinese people, they remember this as one part, which is Yan language, because they see it all the time, everywhere, and then plus this radical. OK? So in Plico, they will show you two parts only. You remember the five parts into one. You don't remember that as six parts because your mind can't remember when it comes to writing. The mind can't remember where do I start. Okay. So this is only two parts. Okay. If you remember as six, I don't know how to how, how you write a character. Okay. So. This is uh, very much what we are teaching you at the very, now at the very beginning, we are teaching you how to associate, okay, you understand this associate, how to learn from one word to learn more words in the Chinese way. In English, how do we do it? We use pronunciation, okay, we use to pronounce. And then the word we use, pronunciation, we change something in pronunciation and becomes a verb to a noun. Unfortunately, you can't do that in Chinese. But we do have a way of learning characters by but associating. What do you associate? You now know yen to do with language. Later on, you will learn lots of Anything to do with language has that character in it. So this is why you need to learn that character as a whole, rather than five different bits. Okay? So there's a system. Don't worry if you can't write it out. You can always catch out. I will. Uh, I will ha uh, happily ask you to actually try it. And the important thing, another thing, is to write with your hands. Why? What What does writing with your hand do to your brain? Yeah, we're training your muscles. Okay? We're training your muscles to send signals to your brain that where the characters come from and how to, how to, like for example, interesting, I see a lot of people, I, I feel really bad for you because when you write, you're shaking. Like I can see the characters you're shaking, okay? You can't write a whole word. Oh my god, you can't draw all this. But no, you're shaking. I can see it here. I can see it. So, oh, this person is shaking. You're nervous. Yeah, nervous. And also, you, haven't, you don't have to sustain the stroke in English. It's like, and then that's it. But in Chinese, you have sustained the stroke. Okay, so it's all early training. It's all early training. Okay, now, uh, now, 介绍的绍. What structure is it? 介绍的绍. What structure? 绍. Do 
uh, shell. What structure? What structure? Left and right. Left and right. Okay? So, ah, oh, 你好。不是不是。so, uh, uh, what is it? No, 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 no. Okay, push, push it. So, in a shop is again, is again, uh, I, I left one stroke because I'm used to writing simplified characters. I'm lazy. Okay, Jie Shao is a left and right character. And Go, how many bits are there in Go? Remember what does Go mean? Tall, right? The taller you go, the better. So some of you have left out the tallest bits. Okay? Some of you didn't write this bit. It needs to be a it needs to have a spire. So very tall. Go. Okay. Uh, right. Okay, some of you have problems with that and Shu has left it. That's okay. And Okay, we're, go we're going to we're, we're re we'll record this, and uh, I think I think we might give you back. We'll record this first. We'll give you back maybe next week because we need to record the marks back. Okay. Now, the, the you two, because you haven't written many characters, is that going to help with you writing characters? Yeah. You have to write. It. <laughs> I know my my, 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 my master students. Say, we couldn't write our thesis. And what's the uh, what, what's my advice to them? Just start writing. Okay? It's the same with learning characters. Just write and then it'll come to you. Okay? So this is basically now sometimes to help you we can give you a story with the characters. But uh, you can always look up on the internet. And my question, they should be in English. Uh, all these characters come from a very traditional way of telling story. They're all, they, 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 they have a story associated with them, okay? And uh, we will try to introduce some to help you with memory. But ultimately, you have to write, and you have to write, use Quizlet to look, to repeat. Repeat. Okay? Huh? All right. I find that it helps to, to, to put, put characters together. Yeah. I think of it as a sentence. Yeah. Sentence yep. Just what do you think? That's right. That's right. Okay. This is interesting. Well, what uh, Bradley said, uh, he puts things together, you know, to memorize them. Means not just isolated mean. Okay. The reason because, okay. In English, we say you need to write 50 words. Okay. How do you tell a word is a word in English? You all write in English. If I ask you write 50 words, what is a word in English? How can you tell visually what's a word? There are. There are, there are, no, there are, space, space. <laughs> you see, I, I will cut out on the, 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 until you know, so there are space in between English words, right, yeah. so basic is one word, root is one word, we know what 50 words is, right, but Chinese, if I say, write at 50 characters. You don't know. Because means is it what means it is name? Is it one word or two words? Yes. That's why you have to learn them together. Means means and also shema you don't learn them separately because it goes with means. Shema means what? In English it's one word but in Chinese it's two words. So if I if I say to you, ah, write fifty words in Chinese, you have no idea how many characters there will be. Alright? I know you you won't do this. In high school, 
they virtually count how many characters they write until the 15th. They said, look, teacher, can we stop now? When I say, but that's only half a word. You have to write a full word because the word definition is Okay, so correct. Bradley say, learn them in sentences. Remember, we taught you everything in sentences because we want to tell you shema is one word and means it is one word. Okay, that's why we teach you in sentences rather than using vocabulary. Okay, ha. all right. Another lecture for me. We'll do this week's wonderful class. All right. So we need to walk around now. Uh, maybe walk around. Do you want to have a rest for five minutes? Okay, five minutes. Yeah. Oh. <laughs> 好难哦，因为你看他们真是写的。